How is your A? Stress here, so just on the side of the of the bow because uh, it has to be very thin sound at the beginning and then it grows quite a lot. So yeah, much much stronger forte mm -hmm. for uh, for this. There are three pickups. Uh, now. So. Uh, three pickups and going on. And th then you play that, uh, the same thing, but with the lower trio. So go ahead and play, the first part doesn't come in for quite some time. One, two, three, pause. Uh, much uh, more forceful. Um, so you got bowings which uh, you're not doing. Oh. So uh, let's let's put them together. So we can actually see what's what's going on. Mm -hmm. so, so for example, do you see that this is done up? Mm -hmm. So can can we take it right right from there? Yes, and then you retake. It has to be a very quick retake because uh, so not with too much bow, so you can right away go there. Uh, and uh, this accent is in piano, so let's let's make it more in, in, uh, appropriate for the context. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, 
Yeah, yeah. Okay, so, yeah. so say your bow. Uh, right, right in your music, you say it. Okay. Uh, so you have to say on the app, though. Okay, so one more time. Three, four. Oh, sorry, I'm playing wrong now. One, three, three. Right, but violin on this uh, you have this uh, octave in unison here so the crescendo has to be really explosive as much as you can to dance uh, so how about from uh, do you know that place so uh, for you it's down up it's it's mm -hmm. this one uh, I am doing opposite because I have to divide CD for Something is not right at, natural. at naturals. Would you please mark it? That's why I prefer paper yeah. just because it takes forever and it, it disturbs the, the pace of of the lesson of this. So right there on that. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Please observe those things. Three, four. Yes, and now uh, you need a better bow division. So this, this down up is just a little click. Ta -da. So can we can get Friday? Three, four. And now, uh, where is the crescendo? Um, on the next. Ah, so one more time. Three, four. No, but the, uh, Ella. <sighs> now, why in the world are you playing in pianissimo with all of the hair at the tip? Please tell me. And if the answer is I'm not thinking, uh, I don't want to hear it. Low sound point for this. You have to be in pianissimo. Low sound point. Three, four. Now, look. Can you do the same thing at the, on the pitch on which you've got it? Three, So uh, well, uh, fine. So first of all, relax. Get get good leverage. We keep saying those things each and every time. I don't know when you you will be able to to actually take care of yourself on this. Uh, I'm uh, I'm tired of repeating them, Ella. You're you're smarter than that. So please please do it. Uh, stuck in, in one very heavy bow dip here. Mm -hmm. 
you're really gripping the bow. You have to let go because this is pianissimo. It has to be super wide. Do you see how my fingers move together with it, with the bow, with the motion? You stay completely. It's it's like you're doing everything from 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 uh, elsewhere. This this is a very fine motor skill moment because these are very delicate notes that you have to play playing them with the big parts means in, in concert they, they're going to suffer This absolutely needs to come off the string in, in broad spiccato. Um, so how about from, from there? Three, four. Uh, this is on the beat. Three, four. Uh, what exactly did you have there? Let me see. Oh, uh, so you uh, separate. Uh, The first violin has here, which is uh, which is very violinistic. You understand what I'm showing you? So, yes. Okay. So, uh, uh, so there is not really a stop or anything. Good. Let, let me see what you've got. Here. That's that's what we have to put. So um, how about one more time from the fortissimo? Three, four. Yes, uh, and then uh, so I have to go to the two. No, you uh, actually just uh, just uh, so you got four, right? Uh, this is this is actually taking you the opposite direction, right? The quarter note on an up bow, right? And then, uh, and then oh, you're doing. Yes, so, you know, we're using different directions. I don't know what Quan will do. I, I don't have his part here. So, you know what? Let's forget. Uh, can, can we back up? Uh, no, this is wrong. Uh, so, let's let's just erase that. Okay, so uh, you will do whatever uh, you're doing. I'll, I'll do whatever I, I can okay. tell in this. So, just, uh, yeah, you get to the tip. Oh, shoot. So. <laughs> So it, it always want to stay more on on the uh, on the string. Uh, can we start right there? One, two, three, four. No, uh, you, you do your bowing. Don't don't get uh, by me. Uh, And uh, all that. This is yes. very heroic, very big. So uh, uh, even you, if you're not sure of the notes, which uh, you you shouldn't be unsure of the notes. So, so uh, is that a G natural? What's it? What is sure. it? I, I I can see. So uh, it, it just be really really very forceful with mm -hmm. the, with that. Uh, same place. Three, four. Yeah, so how long I 
strategies and how do you get vaccines? Oh, the last one. Yeah, somebody has to do them. Mm. <laughs> yeah, together with the, with the first one. So, uh, how about the next? Of the first one of these and the thing crescendo to those repeated notes now uh, as i'm demonstrating you see what i'm doing because you you need to match that and so so there's quite a bit of bow on the uh on the accent so it, it really has to be ground playing three four Okay, so it, it, it really has to drop down to a... Okay, so can you search right on the fourth piano? Yeah. You have to learn to count. Now, if it's difficult for you to see... Uh, do I just touch? Okay, then we need to show the bar lines. Okay. Because this will orient your counting. So, uh, how about on the fourth piano one more time? Three, four. Uh, uh, it's not right. Let me hear you. When we needed it, it wasn't there. Now, when mm -hmm. we don't really need it, it's, it's all just okay. just fingers. It's all... So uh, it, it has to pulse in a very rhythmic fashion. Play with me. Three, four. So again, your eyes has to open just a bit. Yes. Uh, now, um, play the beat. Play the B. Okay, so the G is going to be that much farther up on mm -hmm. the stick, so you, you have to do it. Yes, right. Three, four. Three, four. Slower to, to check the notes. Three, four. Do you have accents together with me? You do. Do you see them? Mm -hmm. Why aren't you doing them? I, I, I got off track. I don't really know. Don't get lost. Three, four. something off right there um, and, and uh, we will keep going so starting that measure three four yeah. and everybody knows 
knows this music, so don't don't think that you will be kind of okay. Right. Or uh, disappearing, so uh, then these chords are, are going to be a little bit fuller. Uh, one more time, slightly quicker, uh, and uh, piano, please. Hmm? You have to do the accents. How are you doing the accents? Yes, you have to pull more bow on them, and uh, you have to think ahead for it. Three, four. of doing this uh, so um, we have chosen to do down 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 on all of it uh, you guys have uh, so the, the third note has to be lighter that's that's mm -hmm. all of it so we can start right there so is that measure 60 uh, yes okay so uh, one no uh, up 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 isn't that what, uh, what the print is? It says in the last one, it's not in the second one. I don't know. It must have come uh, with, with the PDF from my MSLP because, yeah, uh, yeah I, I wanted to give you guys a completely clean music for that. So, uh, up, up, up. So, one. Yes, and the third note really has to be lighter. So, gauge gauge how you, you lighten up the bow. One. No. Uh, Four, one, yes, and one, and one, one, three, mm, and uh, and one, and one, and one, and one, and one. Is such a signature thing that that you let me send it with, with the first violin. Uh, can you take it from uh, this measure here? So uh, in the original they don't have dots, so just a little bit more brushed than staccato. So one. <laughs> Yes, and you, you have the most important part because this chromatic staff oh. then the brings the, yeah. yeah, so it, it's you, okay. that's that's you in diary. Can, can we do from the top of the page one more time? So, one, divine of, uh, of all of them so count you know how your melody fits with the first violin and so let's start right on the uh, fourth piano so one two three go one two Yes, uh, uh, the first violin has an eighth before you play the G. Okay. Okay. So uh, it's uh, for now we will play it very square, so you you hear how things fit together. Same thing. One, two, three, four. One, two. Yeah, uh, 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 but then I rushed. <laughs> yeah. One. Two, 
So right there. Once you get to this bit, you have to be close to the middle of the bow. So it's a, it's a very pianissimo, very light and staccato. So I don't think so. It's a, so a little bit with one hair uh, because this is what creates the ripples and, and the movements in, in all of this. Uh, could we do one more time? Uh, how about from where the harmony changes at the 81? Oh, uh, was that the place? No, 87 is the place where it changes, yeah. Sorry, 87, I looked at the wrong line. Uh, three, four. around just because this uh, you, you can't uh, trip the proceedings it's just these two I missed it I practiced them well uh, it's it's one thing to practice alone it's a different thing to practice with somebody else so uh, how about uh, 87 one more time these things are still a little bit uh, off Okay. 
Right, so please play smooth because you're doing. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, something else that's that's fine okay uh, so when you have your big second beat interruption here you need to come in much stronger okay so uh, let's start from the Neapolitan chord that's uh, one seven, uh, one eighteen is there a dot between the one that's really gonna have it Stronger here. That's that's the one I uh, I meant. Okay. Uh, so uh, yeah. So that's that's uh, yeah. Just just fun. Okay. It really has to be with an accent. Okay. Yeah. That's uh, sorry. I just misread the ones there. Ella, look ahead. Your melody. Right. You don't get to play that many melodies. So, uh, do you think it should be sensitive vibrato? You uh, do? So what? Sensitive vibrato. Do you want? Do you know what that means? It's like soft, like not there too much. Like sensitive vibrato means without vibrato. Okay. Okay. Now you do. Okay. It shouldn't be sensitive vibrato. Uh, play just a sugar. It has to be as vocal and as warm and beautiful as possible. So right there on 125. Oh. 
So that's here. Also, uh, quite full value. Okay. So, can we start right on the second beat? One, one. Yeah, but, uh, but uh, don't don't we both come down to a pianissimo right away? Yes. So uh, we have to do it. One. Uh, it's, it, it's the sound is not disappearing enough, and it's not strong enough on the sforzando part. One. Can you do things for one more time? One. So on, we will start with this for ten for one. Yeah, but, but again, Ella, uh, it it sounds okay. If I'm not looking at you well, you're playing out say, hmm, almost there. Now, why is it almost there? Because you're in the right, wrong part of the bow. You're going with the wrong physical gesture for it. So. Uh, you, B at the tip, it's very light. So this is the shoeshine bowing, so which is down up, down up, down up, down up. And it's very typical, uh, typical for Schubert uh, when you play the uh, Great Symphony, the Ninth Symphony uh, of, uh, of Schubert. Uh, the, the the last movement is is just non-stop. Like this it's uh, it's very virtuosic very difficult if you um, when you're old enough to play the uh, Sibelius violin concerto the last movement has this down it's, it's the same bow stroke in this case it's very delicate at the tip of the bow and it's 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 mainly from here so ready one And uh, do they have dots, the half notes? Mm -hmm. Maybe I'm not uh, lost because I'm going back and forth. Okay, so in the first violin, we, uh, I have the word text here. Um, we should put uh, oops, uh, spaces in between okay. them a little bit, okay? Just a tiny bit of space, uh, same spot. Uh, and again, the sforzano is in pianissimo context, so we should be probably more gentle on it. One. <laughs> That's your theme here. Uh, let me see where, where is that. So, if you, if you need to, to divide that, divide the bows, but it has to sound very coherent and, and beautiful. Uh, can I hear just uh, just you there? Okay. I'll give myself 
more bound uh, maybe change on the C use the whole bow though right you, you don't have to do uh, new accents or anything and there is definitely a taper and diminuendo on that so your up bow will be here try that one more time Yes, that's it. That's much more acceptable. Uh, can we do the same spot one more time? One. Yeah, okay, and so these guys will have spaces. Now, this one won't have a space here. Mm -hmm. So your, your motivic playing starts from here. So these two will be uh, connected. Uh, Okay, so same spot, one more time. Three, four. So, sorry, one. Coach will tell you when you need to be more time. Yeah, so Same that's it. Yeah. Uh, or I can just do it all now. No, you can't. Okay. Uh, because you will run out of the bow. Yes, it, it, uh, it's shaped the same way. So it's always arch shaped. <laughs> Whatever uh, we, we're playing in this music again. Now, can you start this without an accent, though? Yes. Because uh, so so it's uh, again the sweet sweet tune that we had earlier. Same way as earlier, which is space. Oh, sorry. Uh, sorry. Uh -huh. So space, space, connect. Okay. You write that to you know. And do you remember how we were doing these guys? So they're uh -huh. swifts, swifts, but they're at the same time kind of longish uh -huh. and kinsing. Lots of requirements to, to get just the right feel. Can we start with that? Sure. Yeah, let's let's do that. So on on the sforzando. Uh -huh. One. <laughs> Let's be ready to play. Found, found it? Yeah. One. Yeah, and the, again, our articulations are not right. Let's go a little bit slower so we can process when we're spacing, when we're connecting. One. One, two, three, in that tempo. Three, four, one. Uh, 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 one sixty one. Got it? One. Space. Space. So uh, can, can we start from 164, connecting this, uh, connect between the first and the second beat and then dots. Space, same thing, connect. Got it? Can we do from uh, 161? Three, four, one. Uh, this is 
like, you know, uh, it, it's almost like a fascist match, this one. Mm -hmm. You have to be so forceful on, the, on the, all of these. Uh, I, I have those dum bum 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 in fortissimo, and you guys are in in rhythmic unison with the, with the, with all of this. So can you can you be much much more? Uh, yeah, uh, one sixty seven. That's where we're stuck. Yeah. So one. <laughs> and restricted so so, so don't do let's, let's not clip the notes like that so one more time same thing three four So you have to understand the rhythm. So one sixty seven, one more time. Three, four, one. One, two, 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 So three, four, uh, I'll start from here. So three. Don't rush. So can we but, uh, don't rush. So this has to start very, very clean. Yeah, and, uh, uh, yeah. So don't be restricted. Your fingers on the up bow. Needs to do this on the down bow. Need to be mm -hmm. doing this. They 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 either stack or doing the opposite. Uh, yeah. So it's it's a down. The down bow is a downfall with with. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and so you have to pull yourself to a lower part of the bow. group so this is a down bow this is an up bow down bow up bow the down bow you have to feel you see what I'm showing you you're looking in the wrong place the up bow starts down bow is the fall up bow can, can I see you do that on, on an open string because you need to to use the physicality to help you That's, that's what will help you counting to those. So you're starting with an up bow. Sorry. Right with the G sharp. So. B. Yeah, your left hand and right hand are not changing the notes together. The coordination is off. Can you hook the lifting or dropping of fingers in the left hand with down bow and up bow? Oh yeah, I, I know we 
we uh, we are. So can we can we do one more time from one sixty seven? Just make sure that the counting and everything ends up correctly. Three, four. Can you find it, please? One, six, seven. Four. Oh, you 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 play on the same beat though. Just one sixty-seven. Isn't it? Oh yes. No, uh, seven is here. Uh, what number is this? Is, is that six? Three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. Okay. So actually, it it wasn't working because you were coming in a, a measure too soon, and because I have the same notes, we we didn't we didn't catch it. So I have. Um, Three, four, one, two, one, two. Yes, so you play on that two. Uh -huh. One, two, one, two. Which uh, means that you, you need to match that. Not that I was in tune this time, but you weren't either. Uh, can can we can we do this one more time? We do. Uh... Yeah, I, I just messed up uh, all mm -hmm. that stuff. So uh, same spot. Three, four, one, two. Of those, which you know, if you're playing middle voice, it, it, it could happen. Uh, you kind of have to restart yourself with every downbeat. So think, ta 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 ya ta 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 ya ta 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 ya ta ta ta. So that uh, that will be what uh, what helps you uh, to stay together. And you start them in which measure? Uh, one eighty one. One eighty one. Okay. So let's let's start right there. Three. Okay, so uh, with the other voices, it's very much easier. Your mom will expect you to, to get the um, at least uh, things in the recap are going to uh, repeat. Uh, so now here's my assignment for you. When you listen to this piece at home, listen what the first violin is doing because you have to accompany this in a, in a very skillful way. Again, it would be much easier with the other voices because they, they will beats be beats there. But the, uh, now. Uh, it is possible that the melody might take a little bit of time and you might have to do a little bit of adjustment right. with the syncopation, so... And things might just uh, relax a little bit uh, more. It felt really, really fast for me yeah. uh, right here. But uh, could we do this one more time and see if we, we can actually feel the, the, the beat? It's, it's, it's very hard. So, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so that 
be uh, again if it matches you with the added voices um so can I can I hear just just you because we, we need both voices to be able to uh, the added voices to be able to play. Okay, you mind starting from here? Yeah, uh, can it be better in tune? The G flats don't match. So uh, I will start the bar before that, okay? okay. So and one, two, one, three, four, one. Uh, no, no, no. It's, it's the same situation as before. You 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 have to come after the first two calls. So one, da, so one. Page of syncopations again, don't get stuck at the, the tip for those. Uh, where's our next thing that we play? So, letter E, I don't yeah. have letters. So, what, what measure number is this? A 189. 289. 280 or 39? Oh, 39. Okay, okay, so let's do 239. One, two, three, four. You're not on the right spot in the measure. Three, uh, ready? Three, four, one. Where, where 
you see uh, two thirty nine for you? Yeah, you you have to count that there. So uh, one, two, three, four, one. <laughs> So, uh, where did you get off? Yeah. Where did you get lost? So, can can I hear for you to hear? These are just octaves, right? So, yeah, but nice and big. more sense if it needs to go like that. Oh, okay. um, can we can we redo this? Uh, where does that begin for you? Uh, let's do uh, two, what measure number is this? this is oh, sorry, I, I, I did not. So, uh, 249 is where we will start. Okay. One, ready? One, two, three, four. <laughs> Right, so you listen to, to the beats of, of, the, of the other instruments. Um, before you play with the recording, though, you, you need to figure out your parts. Um, yeah. 